Alright, what's up guys? We're back, and we got a fantastic game in store for you guys. I, I hope, at least. Um, between Xanthor here, legend, like an absolute legendary raw player and overall player, and someone that you're probably more familiar with, Magic, who's still around today, playing Aranos. So, what yeah. do you think of this matchup? He's, he's one of the last standing experts still from that era. It's the only one who still plays, kind of. Yeah, there's a few that's come back, but they're just not the same. Like to keep, they haven't adapted well to the meta. Yeah. yeah. M Magic's his career just has been like great for him. It's, it's got him <laughs> in the game. <laughs> the, his, his, his curry stores have never run out. <laughs> yeah. So, but yeah, uh, you can see uh, Magic just walking his scouts everywhere, just scouting it out. So I scout for some more curry. <laughs> <laughs> um, he's scouting really well right now, actually, though. He yeah. has good TC placement, especially for this ESO. Is it, it's, in a, it's in a line, like, it's in a straight line. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's no front or back TC. Whoever <laughs> scripted this map well had, like, massive OCD, probably. <laughs> it was Kermaku, probably. <laughs> <laughs> so you can see uh, Xanthor uh, snatching away a relic. Oh my god, what a fucking bastard. <laughs> he's Actually, like, I fucked you. Oh, he's going for some archaic aggression abuse. What a fucker. So he's scouted out the medium gold mine so he knows that he has a forward one. It's very important information to get. And <laughs> damn. <laughs> <laughs> he's totally. Like it's, it's, I can stole his coats, dude. That's BM yeah, as fuck. <laughs> But there comes the Oracle. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna be a war for the goats. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be ballsy if Magic turned his Oracle into a hero. I would laugh really hard actually. Sometimes like noobs, they do that a lot. Like, they'll just turn their Oracle into a hero. They're like, yeah, I think that's a good idea. It's gonna pay itself off and then they lose it or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stupid. It also slows your classical time down so much. So you never wanna do that. Yeah. But unless you're trolling and you know what you're doing. Mm. Indeed. Although I I highly doubt he'll be uh hearing his oracle, to be honest. Yeah. So Magic was trying to be clever and walk the goats away fast, but he noticed it. <laughs> The war of the goats, dude. I love it. The aggression is already so soon. Yeah, it's two minutes into the game and they're going head on against each other. <laughs> I mean, it's no skipper versus, like, um, what's his name? Uh, Intel. GP. Yeah, on ALF, but it's. Oh, it's, yeah, it's, the way the villagers. Yeah, but it's good. It's good. This is this is good for me. I, I'm enjoying this. I'm like, Kali, go. <laughs> Dude, there's like two lions right there and then one baboon. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. That's ridiculous. It's o this oasis is fucking cancer. So we actually like got the relic for the more food. Like, villagers carry more food. That's really strong. Uh, this map is good for both players' gods, though. Like, it's super good for Raw, but it's also, like, incredibly good for Aranos, obviously. Yeah. The so the settlement for the Raw player is actually far further away than the Aranos one. Yeah, well, it's really far away, actually. The goal placement favors magic, I'd say. Well, it kind of. Mm. Well, yeah. Look at. It. It's kind uh, of weird placed. Actually, I lied. It's kind of favoring, okay, uh, Xanthor a little bit. It it's really the bands who can take control of the mines. Yeah, that's yeah, that's what I was just. They're pretty far up though. Dude, fo taking out fog of war triggers me so hard. I don't know why. <laughs> so, uh. <laughs> Dude, um. Did you see uh, his Oracle? Got killed, by the way? Oh, no, I missed that. Um. He, he go up, go up, go up, up to Xanthor's base. He walled them in with houses near Xanthor's base. Oh, okay. yeah, I see. <laughs> I see the building. Smoke yeah. coming out. <laughs> oh, oh, so he was actually empowering the wall. That's stuff you don't see much. That's boss. I love it. Oh damn, he even got the goats in the fucking corner. Right in the fucking <laughs> corner. <laughs> Math hacking. <laughs> Little ru lucky raids or lucky uh, uh, scoutings. Yeah, some lucky scouting dog. Let's go have the magic perspective for a second. I want to see what's going on here. Oh, 
So he's actually taking a uh, second TC. This is so uh, like a magic like ask like to do this. It's so magic ass, dude. Because like he just always does this against raw players. But like I'm pretty sure it's a normal strategy for like a Lanny to do against Eggy. But like yeah. he does it, like every fucking time. It's so strong too. It's so yeah. strong. Especially against Raw because they will usually attack around ten minutes or twelve minutes. So yeah. you got quite a bit of time to prepare your defenses with a boom. Yep, exactly. And um you can boom really hard on this map too, because all you do is build termos. <laughs> yeah, that's very true. You just harass with those termos and keep your opponent in the base while you boom. Yeah, and then when you as a Rano, so you're gonna out boom them like almost every every time. Like, hands yeah. down. Oh, I know what I'm happy about is I'm hoping. Are, are we prop? Uh, oh, I just wait a second. Pause that. Rhino. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pause what I was saying. He needs to drop the gold off. <gasps> oh, and okay. the shockwave, did you see that snake just uh, that was, in midair? That was really like fast reaction time of magic, actually. That was insane reaction time. Yeah. It's smart though, because now he has the second TC. Oh my god, yeah. That was, I, maybe that was what he was planning. Yeah. So he took out the Terma. And this seems, this DC seems to be go going down really fast. Uh, CC is going to be going down 100%. So he's taking out the Promethan with uh, the heroes. And he's got 400 gold in the bank to take the TC. What a good boy. This Magic is really, Center. really well executed by uh, Centaur. Yeah, that was very nicely played. But I mean, like. If I was in Magic's position, it would be hard for me to keep my composure because I hate this cheese. It's yeah. Really the 1 HP uh, citizen not getting in the way. <laughs> I'm wondering oh. though, is that 1 HP of the villager that is carrying the donkey with him? Or is, is it the donkey that has 1 <laughs> HP left? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. He stole anyway. his goats in the end anyway. At least all his goats in the end. Yeah, he still stole them. <laughs> he could have just given them away for free to begin with. <laughs> it's, Magic's too prideful, dude. He's never, he's never gonna do that. Oh, dude, Magic, come on! Don't so they're like, this. let's have a one for one, bro, and then they're like, nah, nah, nah. Yeah, it's like the legend, like meet me at Baron, <laughs> and then it's like, it's a team team, lol. I don't need a one v one, you. Know? Took him out though. The hero. I shot Shank Redemption. Shank's ass. Wait, what the fuck? He just he was walling in a house. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe there was like a citizen inside. It's like you're playing Rust and you got your own base and then they just wall you in. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, you have to get the off the box first, Lawrence. Come on. You should know that. Yeah. What the hell is going on over here? I believe Magic's still in the... Well, I mean, I'm not, no, I'm not surprised actually. It's just Magic, but like... I don't know, I'd be so bad for some reason. This is such an insane game to like, I'm not keeping count of how many villagers Magic has already lost. I'm surprised he has so many villagers, like, or as many villagers he, as he has right now, you know, like, yeah. I thought he lost a lot, but he has a decent villager count, actually. So but he's like, using the villagers as a siege weapon. <laughs> I mean, fist like, the tower down is most effective. Don't they do extra damage to towers or something? Yeah, plus hundred for fifty percent. This is actually ah, uh, dude. I don't know who. Oh, this is gonna be a grindy ass game, bro. Fuck. It's like who can take control of the resources here? <laughs> <They're> like, <laughs> I would just be so like annoyed because in terminal you can just suicide basically into tower fire. Yeah. It's very you nice micro though. He he was garrison some villagers inside. When they were low HP. Yeah, I mean, I hope, I hope God he would be doing that. Yeah. Boston out right now though. Dude, Santor, like, uh, dude, like this looks like this looks like hell for him now. Like <laughs> tables have turned. Yeah, he's just getting in and out and sniping the Terma. Jeez. This really shows how strong. Like, uh, like how hard, 
uh, or how much you can be punished rather by uh, doing belly rush. Like yeah. If, if, who knows what they're doing? Like they can really punish you. Sometimes it's actually better to not take a TC because it's just a huge, huge investment for and gold, and food. Yeah. Oh. Uh. It's kind like of tricky though because of this. The villagers they have the skin of the rhino upgrade, so they're extra tough. Yeah, it's true. But he's picking them off little by little here. Yeah. It's like in the SpongeBob episode, and the, the fish guy is like asking you, how, how tough are you? And you're like, I got skin of the rhino, man. <laughs> <laughs> how tough are you? I survived the Vulcan villager rush, bro. <laughs> the <Sopranos. laughs> Oh, damn. The, the men are micro, though, with the termos in and out. Sweet. Sweet, sweet micro. This is insane though, like look at all the fucking bodies on the fucking ground, bro. <laughs> but the bodies in the <laughs> Yeah, he just lost a lot of turbos though, I should probably All the chill. bodies getting fucking like on top of each other, like uh, it's a wall, like Game of fucking, Thrones. It's like necrophilia. He's doing good though, like he has an eco in his home base too. Yeah, I'm surprised. Yes, I the barracks. First barracks, 11 minutes, 30 seconds, so, baby. Yeah. It's gonna give it another try at building the army. I think Magic should try to take a... another TC. Oh, he's going to sec met. What a fucking boss. I love this. Got it back to his point of view. So. Oh, yeah, he's going. To, he's actually going to sec met. That means, yes, he's going to have a citato. A potato? What? A citato. Oh, Citadel. <laughs> Citadel, yeah, yeah, that's it. Oh, shit, yeah, you're right. So he's going to use it on this town center. Yeah, I mean, that'd be the, that'd be the play. The yeah. Play, then those javelins are going to do, like, nothing anymore. Not like they're doing anything right now, but... Oh, well, I mean, they're, they're doing them. They're killing the villagers just doing yeah. the job. But, yeah, they're not obviously doing anything to the town center. <laughs> <laughs> got to throw javelins at this building all fucking day, like... It's not gonna do shit, nigga. So he's building a monument of the soldiers. The magic, magic has resecured almost this this area right here. Yeah. Just raiding in TC range. Just circling around the TC. Which is fine. Like he can do that for fucking ever. Yeah, he can just remake, refill the army. Like you're at the restaurant and you want some more Fanta, you just refill. <laughs> Fanta. <laughs> there is this citadel. It's there it is indeed. But it's not like it really matters. There's nothing here anymore. Yeah. Just like I'm gonna hide uh, food for six months in the citadel. <laughs> you can poke me all you want, bro. Magic's house right now. Oh, he's not even at full pop, pop actually. Is what I meant to yeah, say. 91 out of 95. So he's Did all over the map though. He's controlling the gold mines with the manners. Yeah. He's got great APM. So Stop, yeah. dude. He's not giving him any leeway here. <laughs> like, he's just putting his foot down on his neck. It's like, yeah, you're not getting up, bro. Like, He's putting the food in between the door. <laughs> oh, there's the scarabs raiding. Scarab there. raid, baby. I love yeah. it. Old school. Old school. But Stra yeah, magic definitely needs some more, more mamillos or like destroyers or anything. Just something to take down this TC. It's so juicy right now. I mean, it's it's so like juiced up rather. Yeah, it's like open. It's like come at me. No, it's juice. Like the health is like fucking thirty six hundred. Oh yeah, yeah, for sure. And there's the bonus attack damage too because villagers are inside. Yeah. Seventeen attack. Damn. The fact that guy's chilling there is like, yo, it's good. Here come that boy. He's swinging his fucking. Uh... Well, now he's dead, dressed in pepperoni pizza. Ah, uh, this is the good old days. You had three charges on your fucking valor. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Magic's going Hyperion. What a fucking... Oh my fucking god. Boss. It's not BM. bad, honestly. Against the Scarabs. It's BM, it's BM bro. 
Yeah, so fucking VO, yeah, Spend dude. those satyrs. <laughs> so he's actually getting the, the Migdal up. Satyrs were so fucking shitty then. Actually, I don't know. I, I'm, oh my god, he's murking. Is this chemo? <laughs> Working hard. He's bringing out his zebra horses. Zebra horses. <laughs> I've never seen a horse that looked like that, and I don't think they will ever. I'll ever see one. Yeah, I think it's like leather on the horse back. It's like uh, clothes for the oh, horse. Okay. There comes the setter. Stakes were made. It's the horny spear guy. <laughs> the horny spear guy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He's mining his gold and everything. He came in his house, opened his fridge, started eating his fucking food. Yeah. Taking his money, ordering pizza. <laughs> <laughs> this is insane Headings? though, like he they they didn't base switch, but he just took his base. <laughs> it's like mine now, like These lands are ours. That's my name on it, didn't you see? Yeah. Dude, imagine on one TC, I love this. I love it. It's just like you're not even bothering to go like Oh, I did. His macro is kind of bad. I don't know. Though. He's got so many on wood. Yeah. He has 2k wood in the, in the storage. You could trade all that wood and go mythic right now. Yeah. And these clay men are just like chilling here. Yes, yeah, Prometheans is like, oh, <laughs> that's good, bro. Like, Let's regroup. Oh, my nigga, he's building fucking uh, satyrs too. Yeah. Oh. He's stacking oh. them up. Uh, what a. Fucking baller! Holy shit! The only thing though is, at his main base, Xanthor is like, he's like basically free, like gathering resources. It's like no harassment's going on at all. Yeah, he recognizes that he's wide open though, so he built a wall, for protection. Yeah. Virginity protected. <laughs> but Magic's committing to retaking his base. It looks like so. Yeah, he he just wants to poke in and poke out. Yeah. Which doesn't look like he's gonna be raiding his actual main base. He's like an annoying Facebook friend that just pokes you for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> just, I, I, I had a friend like that actually. <laughs> 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 fucking asshole, isn't it? Alright, come to destroyers. Yeah. The pitchforks. The pitch <laughs> I never understood how a guy with a pitchfork could be effective against buildings, but I, I don't know. What do I know, right? I don't know. What do I know? Eventually, it will catch fire, probably. Yeah, because that's how you start a fire, the pitchfork. <laughs> and and a stone building. <laughs> that's how they invented fire back then. Yeah, 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 that's how it works. He's making wadgets here. Maybe, uh, he should have went half so he makes some pistachios. Oh, there checks. comes the chaos. Oh, chaos is so bad back then. Actually, no, I got three. Inspector, uh, watch it down. Inspector, watch it. <laughs> the claimant are finally re reclaiming their houses. Uh, I was actually, uh, I thought it was going to be a lot worse. I thought it only did like two things or something. No, it, it does like three uh, units. Oh, it, d it doesn't guarantee a myth unit though in this. Yeah, but... that's that's the reason why it is considered bad. They fixed that yeah. though in uh, EE. Yeah. I don't think it's the best idea to hit a TC with a set there, but... <laughs> well, yeah, I, uh, I don't know, man. Maybe he's got some um, some strats that we don't know about, you know what I mean? Maybe, maybe it does extra damage. Some elite 2k strats. <laughs> shockwave. Yeah. Nice shockwave. Uh, rest in peace, a little shockwave. This villager is shocked for life. That, shock, that shockwave is GC. The old one, four seconds, baby. Oh, uh, finally he's taking that TC, my nigga. Nice. No, I think he's also taking the other one to the side of his. So original. yeah, if you play Atlantean, by the way, what I like to do personally is in our in archaic. If you want to take a TC, you should take a TC with one villager. But if you're gonna take one in classical and above HS, then you want to take TC with two villagers. That's the best. Yeah, it's optimal. Yeah. But as you say that. <laughs> <laughs> He's contradicting my uh, T 
tips. Yeah. He needs to build another house though too. It's really tricky. Yeah, <laughs> oh my <laughs> god. He just lost his sense <laughs> to the Lion King. And, his and then the monkey's right there. Sensor's right there. He's you chilling. like chilling like magic? Is that you? Magic boy, I only play 2% power. <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me enrage and take down the palace. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, these wadgers are going ham. They got their ears flip flapping like chemo. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like, I'm, this game is like fucking. It'd be so hard for me to play this game. Like, just it's, it's insane. Like, so hard. Like, this game is just really hard to to win on either side. I'd say. I think you should go. Uh, Okay, though. Oh yeah, definitely. To his own oh, uh, uh, gold mine. Yeah, I thought. Yeah, I thought he had. Or I saw he had a lot of resources before, but I guess since he started producing more, more um, stars and shit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He definitely has to hit the supermarket soon for some more food. <laughs> supermarket. <laughs> I think Xanthar is probably gonna try to up here. Actually, he's going for a rain. He's looking to go mythic probably. Yeah, he's probably gonna look to go mythic. Well, it's, he'll have enough food shortly. Yeah, and then uh, he can potentially trade the food for gold. Yeah, trade all the wood he has to. Yeah. If he really wants to go get up there. Which I assume he would, because then he can actually go for a push. Yeah, he can tornado his base or something. Yeah. Position he's in is really bad right now, though. He's actually in a terrible position. Yeah. Because, you know, these destroyers are so good against Lanyon. Er, sorry, the destroyers are so good against Aggie. Yeah, they are, definitely are. And then the Marmelos. He's just like magic to army comp. It's amazing, basically, is what I'm trying to say. For Yeah, he has the turbo for the slingers, he has the destroyers for the buildings, and just tank and stuff as well. The shard is just good against Aggie because usually you can expect Aggie to build a bunch of chariots, even though he's not right now. He has a bunch of slingers anyway, so that's Pierce. Yeah. So Xanthor is actually switching to X Men now on one barrack. Smart, two barracks. If I was Magic, I'd probably try to kill Buddy's fucking like, barracks right now it's first before. I... Yeah, that's the main cost that is keeping Magic from taking a TC right now. Like, if he just killed those, he would be, he'd be perfectly fine. Yeah, it's much easier to take out the barracks than the Citadel. Citadel, yeah, you got Citadel. it. Citadel, yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah, you should kill the barracks and then Micro is like Termos to kill the Slingers and then he'd be in good shape. Yeah. But he's going a little two balls deep here. Oh my god, this is a good meat shield, the Scarabs, actually. The Curry has taken too much control of his mind. <laughs> it's the Korean meta right here, bro. <laughs> Korean. It's a Korean meta with the fucking scarabs fighting in your army, dude. <laughs> like, who the fuck does this shit? Like, usually you make scarabs and you like scarab rush and you attack buildings or whatever with them, right? But like, yeah, this dude is like, I don't know, fuck. Like, Use them whatever I feel like. So, so this game is like all over the place right now. We have we have magic fighting here, doing some backdoor in action. <laughs> Six back A. Six back. <laughs> oh my god, did I do think these guys must have a crazy? Oh, I know magic is good AP. I like really good. Yeah. Like, Santa was. <laughs> like you will see these destroyers like shifting over to the other side with Cas like Cassidy, just flashing over to the next. <laughs> Uh, is that TC really gonna stay up though? That's crazy. Yeah, he has the amp power on it. Yeah. So that's gonna stay up. You should, oh, dude. When you're playing against Aggie, like, come on, you need to get a fucking. The only thing that like really pisses me off when people don't get the uh, Pierce upgrade for the armor. Oh yeah. You I definitely want the Pierce upgrade against Egypt. Just OCD. Maybe. He's going on the Pilgrim uh, adventure. Hold on a second. Pause. It. Look at. Look at. Look at Magic's um, population. He has three town centers, bro. Yeah. So what's going on? He should have 160. Uh, I think he is lacking a manor. I I remember 
that he that uh, the siege tower destroyed the manor here. Oh shit! Okay, okay. That's probably the reason why. Yeah, I was like, what the fuck's going on? Dude, the citadel was so OP though. Holy shit! You were like, what is this magic? Yeah, I was so confused, like, cause I've seen it happen to me before. Maybe I was just bad, whatever. Usually yeah. it's a lack of house, sis. Yeah. You no, turn I had the house music. I had my house as max, but it was being weird for some reason. But uh, okay, magic. Stop building terma magic. There's so I many. Guess it's that time of the game where you want to stop building termas. Like even though we as the slingers, like destroyers and mills are going to easily deal with the slingers right now. No, uh, I mean the 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 terma actually deal with these axemen too because they're such low peers. But like he needs more mil like he needs more melee units to kill the fucking citadels. Yeah. It's amazing. Like this citadel is giving uh, Xantor such a huge pop advantage right now. Magic lost another house. Oh my god, Magic rebuild your house. <laughs> so he's going to be losing that palace. That's why he's losing this game. He doesn't have the houses. Yeah, he's actually popped right now. He has the resources <laughs> for more units, but he's like he has he doesn't have the houses. He has literally 40 more population you could utilize him, but it's a tough game, so I can't really blame him. Yeah, I can imagine that these players right now are like tunnel vision as fuck. <laughs> it's like yeah. they're in a Justin Timberlake song, tunnel vision. You're going hard, hard as fuck. As soon as he rebuilds these houses, though, I think he wins. Like, oh yeah. Like, he needs to do that first, obviously. Oh. Oh no, he lost that town center, that was my bad. He needs to just rebuild one more house. Yeah. I forgot about that. It's like a little guy sitting in a siege tower and he's like shooting <laughs> arrows through the window that's going to he's open. He's shooting fucking like blow darts or something. <laughs> it's fucking Timo. <laughs> Timo is sitting with his fucking poison darts in the siege tower. He's like, Kevin, Timo. Timo on duty. <laughs> God, don't Every mention time that. he ramps his fucking team of cock on the buildings. Dude, don't mention that fucking disgusting thing to me. <laughs> fucking Timo. Get a PTSD flashbacks about fucking Timo. And there comes <laughs> the elephants. Oh, this is looking really bad for Magic. He can't fight all over. He's been fighting in that one spot all game. Yeah. <laughs> he needed to multitask a little bit more, I think. Because these elephant raids is coming. <laughs> like in the he learned really well from Skipper, I can tell. <laughs> These citizens, they look like they just got spawn act like into the game. <laughs> <laughs> they did. You didn't see that? <laughs> <laughs> He's killing the goat. What the fuck? He has a little console comment ready. <laughs> he's spawn. <laughs> Anytime he's going to spawn a crystal titan in his base. <laughs> and yeah, no one's gonna notice. Just GGL. <laughs> Who's gonna notice? Who's gonna care? This is actually a GGL game. Yeah, it it's is. a tournament game, yeah. Yeah, Global Gaming League, old school. I forgot to mention that at the beginning, but yeah, guys, it's a tournament game. That's, I mean, these are typically better than normal games for obvious reasons. Well, yeah. If you don't understand, I'll explain that um, people will play harder for money and for like bragging rights. Especially sure, Magic, man. He's known to go hard for money. <laughs> money bags, Magic. <laughs> Curry master. <laughs> he needs to buy his curry. And Nelly. <laughs> it was Wadget though, MVP of the game. Yeah, he's Wadget and the Scarabs are giving him the fucking the one, two. Fucking. Some more spawn hacks. <laughs> <laughs> They're like confused, like. They're so nicely placed though, like in, in a row, you know? Yeah, it really. Uh, God, you know the board game like four in a row. Aesthetic. Four in a row. <laughs> <laughs> Magic has so many resources too. It's, oh wait, I just saw he had a bunch of gold. What the fuck happened? <laughs> and then like when someone posts this game, like typical like. Um, Reaction and be like, yeah, I was tired. It was early in the morning. I wasn't playing, but well, pretty sure that's exactly what Magic said. I, mean, I didn't eat my dinner yet or my breakfast.
breakfast. <laughs> it's so fucking AIDS. I'm like, yeah, I was tired. It was early. <laughs> I just got back from work. My dog ate my homework. <laughs> I had to redo it. Like, I was tired, which made me play bad. Nah. Magic is a great player. Don't get me yeah. wrong, though. He's a really good player. He's definitely one of the best. Making fun of the excuses that people give yeah. Arthur Sanctuary. But yeah, Magic is one of the GOATs. 100%. One of the GOATs. Even though he got his GOAT stolen in this game, he's the GOAT. <laughs> By GOAT, I mean he loves his GOAT. Pet GOAT, Billy has. <laughs> I give healthy gold and trade for gold. <laughs> Not as... <laughs> Okay. No, man. Oh, seriously, he's fucking good ass, dude. Those heavy cool. slingers, though. They got like the new ho hoodies. It's a new trend of 2005. They got revamped turbans. <laughs> 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 this elephant is ramming down that manner. Yeah, he's like, fuck this. He's like, I'm moving in here. <laughs> fuck this, I was in particular. He wants, to, <laughs> he wants to move his family in there. <laughs> All the baby elephants. <laughs> oh, okay. This is uh, this is a strong yeah. yeah. Okay, <laughs> I was just like that's such a strong army by Xanthor. What? What? GG <laughs> <laughs> <G> boys. <laughs> this is such a like. Uh, this is typical magic, bro. <laughs> this is that is that a T? What is the other one? I don't know. It's like a H, maybe. Dude, maybe ran out of gold. <laughs> yeah. And Magic does this all the time, actually. It's, it's like a out, out, like wall right in your base, bro. When I win. Nah, he he just BM sometimes by doing that. He'll build like a wall in your base or like a lighthouses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the the one, <laughs> the, the lighthouses against racing. <laughs> yeah, he made like thirty lighthouses in raising his base in the tournament. <laughs> It was like, yo, buddy, when you, when now are you gonna resign, eh? But yeah, that was a good game, though. Yeah, shit. what a game. So, what a game. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, uh, it's the time of the video again. So uh, we'll see you guys next time, man. Yeah. Peace, boys.